Believe it or not, guys, I was one of the first ones here. It was very empty. And now, suddenly, a lot of people have just arrived just to uh, just even before, one minute before the restaurant opens. So it means that in Ninov, this, this place must be something really interesting because uh, uh, this entire main road is a bit quiet. And then this restaurant, uh, this uh, Sunday restaurant brings life here, guys. So this must be something really cool. Uh, by the way, as soon as I arrive in Ninov, the first thing I see is a McDonald's stand right there. McDonald's is everywhere in Belgium. <laughs> And so is uh, other big chain restaurants like Pizza Hut, Burger King. Their menu, it is so organized. They have all sorts of things on board. Oh my goodness. Milkshakes, ice creams, ice specialties, pancakes, waffles. The list is endless. They even have cocktails here. Literally a Sunday restaurant with a cocktail. You know, I'm tempted to try their cocktails, but Let's see how it goes. Right here, everyone. So I just passed my first order and uh, let's see how this goes, guys. He gave me chocolate milkshake right here. Mm -hmm. mm. This tastes so good. The milkshake. It tastes amazing. Hey guys, you have no idea what they just gave me. They gave me a nice apple tart with ice cream. They kept too much flour on top that I cannot talk too close because the flour will go flying everywhere. Oh my gosh. This, this looks so delicious. Let's try this right now. Mm. Oh, this tastes so good. Real good. With the ice cream. Mm. I can confirm, this is so good. If you look at the texture of the apples, it's all chips, guys. It's all uh, little blocks of apple. Then they gave me crepes as well, guys. The crepes come up near. One. All right, so I'm in a town called Gerardsbergen. Gerardsbergen is at the uh, west side of uh, Belgium. Uh, so it's like at the far west of uh, Brussels, uh, not very far from a place called Ninov. Now Gerardsbergen is uh, it's, it's very interesting uh, what I'm seeing right here. This has to be the first Flemish town which has quite a good number of hills I've ever visited, guys. It's so much hills. I actually confused it for Namur at one point or for a French-speaking region. It's very quiet here, guys. I get the whole street to myself, basically. It's very, very quiet. Found this nice restaurant in Gerardsbergen and uh, here, I got given the menu. It's really interesting. Let's see how this goes. I just passed my first order. Let's see how this goes. Honestly, there was not very much on the menu. So it seems like this place wasn't really intended as a, what's well, a brasserie, but it's it's got not much content on the menu. All right, guys, so I got given this as a starter. This is some sort of chili starter. Interesting. Tastes good. Feels like it tastes like bolognese a little bit for some reason, but it's really good, guys. Look at the way they provide the uh, the salad, guys. It's like a flower pot. It's interesting. <laughs> it's really good. I like it. Yep, the city of Gerardsbergen, everyone. All right, guys, now I'm gonna try this ice cream uh, place. And uh, this ice cream place is far more amazing. It's not very crowdy out here compared to my last experience in uh, other towns. This is far more pleasant, guys. I get this whole place to myself. I'm the first customer here and it's so cool because I remember my experience in Ninov. Uh, Ninov is just a town in nearby. And gosh, the ice cream parlor was full. Like even the place didn't even open and there were people crowded outside. Alrighty guys, I got given pancakes. I'm try this. 